The first day of school is right around the corner for many school districts around the area, but one local school district will have a different look this year. Clayton Castle has a story. Coming off a run through the state boys basketball tournament, the Crosby Ironton School District recently announced a rebranding plan, including implementing two new logos. The first one is a facelift of the old logo, combining the rich mining heritage of the Iron Range area and the new Cuyuna Lakes destination. We also wanted to give uh, give that uh, logo a, a facelift, if you will, and, and really kind of represent the new competitive edge of our students that are uh, learning in our school districts of the 21st century. The second logo is a more generic logo, which will be used at other schools and activities within the district. It's framed in such a way that we can uh, insert various activities within that generic logo. So that's why we came up with the two different logos. Now the superintendent says that the school district's rebranding is part of a larger community rebranding, saying that as new attractions such as the Cuyuna Country State Recreational Area mountain bike trails and the Iron Range Eatery open, the community is going from more of a mining community to a tourist destination. We are going through this transformation right now. It's, uh, we're transforming from a, an iron mine based community to a community that's based on the natural resources such as our mountain bike trails, our paved trails. People come here from all over to go scuba diving in our mine pits. And the district's logo is not the only thing getting a facelift. But beyond the logo, what we're going to be current, our next steps is we're going to be developing a new website here for the school district. Again, just trying to keep up with the 21st century styles of communication, how our audiences want to communi be communicated to and with. While it will take some time to fully implement the new brand, the district will introduce the school community to the new looks when school opens on September 5th. Reporting Crosby Ironton, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. The entire implementation process of the rebranding is expected to take 18 to 24 months. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.